In this video, we are going to try to transform this old ugly fireplace into something a little better looking. If we can keep the dog hair out. Hi Cooper. So let's get started. They say that 90% of a good paint job is the prep work. So we got out the scrub brush and a little soapy water and scrubbed and scrubbed and scrubbed. After it was clean and dry, it was time to finally start painting. We are using this medium gray color for the base coat. I think we ended up putting two base layers on, taking our time to fill in all the mortar joints and texture of the bricks. Once the base coat was done, we opened up some white paint and mixed a little of the gray base color and just started painting random bricks. We did this probably four or five times, going a little lighter in color each time until we were only using white paint, again trying to be as random as possible. It's all about layers to give off a realistic stone look. Then it was on to the firebox. So we started off again, cleaning, vacuuming, and cleaning some more. I then used a piece of cardboard as a shield and sprayed the firebox with a high heat black spray paint like you might use for a barbecue grill. After that, it was onto the tile, so we needed to thoroughly clean again. I got this can of paint in my local Ace Hardware. Someone had returned. It seemed like a good color, so we went with that. After using up the whole can on multiple coats, I was feeling artsy, so I went back and painted in fake grout lines. Again, it's all about the layers and the details. After another good cleaning, it was time for the stencil. We ordered this stencil online, and there's all kind of options out there. We got the stencil lined up straight using a little painter's tape and rolled the stencil with the same base gray color on the bricks. After the stencils were painted, I put a total of five coats of poly to seal it up and hopefully it won't chip. Here is the before and after. This was a very time-consuming process. This probably took at least a week or more between letting paint dry and cleaning dog hair. If you like this video, please like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one. Thanks for watching.